The 93-year-old Mary Rumu was the widow of the Archbishop Janan Rumu, murdered in 1977, making him a martyr in the Anglican Church. This evening, Archbishop Stanley Tagali visited the home of Ben Rumu, the son to the deceased, to condole with the family. She was the wife of the third Archbishop of Uganda, who became the martyr of the 20th century. So we want to give glory to God. She is no longer in pain. She is in the hands of the Lord. Archbishop Puntagali had only good things to say about Mary Rumu. And all the Christians, young and old, we want to give our sympathy to this family. Honor of Ben and your, uh, your siblings, your children and grandchildren, the entire family, Kitigum Diocese. We want to say we are with you and we celebrate the life of a great mother of the Church of Uganda. This is my story. Her son Ben Lumu, a former Minister of Lands, from 1986 to 1991, recalls the hostile days leading to his father's death in 1977. Ben Lumu, now 70 years old, says he was 27 at the time. Some of those soldiers who were there to ask, uh, where is the Archbishop? Where Your is mother. the Yeah, my mother. And uh, I think one of them came and told her that uh, you go and look after your children. Do not waste your time here. Uh, she was happy generally about uh, the way her late husband has been now recognized. Uh, in 1998 when he was made a saint. He recalls that his father had been accused of collaborating with rebels opposed to President Idamini. And in actual fact, I think most of, this, most of the things against him were fabricated by Amin. Very, very, very brutal regime. There was a lot of killings. Ben Rumu's sister, Julie Rumu Adriko, was in the house when the army evaded their home at Namirembe and also explains how her mother helped them to cope after the death of their father Rumu. It was not an easy thing. And then she had to deal with the issue of bringing up children single-handed. Well, she brought us up well. Some of the children were still in school. Personally, I was already working, but some of my younger siblings were still in school. Daramoi Rumo, a brother to the late Archbishop Rumo, also praised the life of the woman that they recalled Mama Mary Rumo. Generally, is a working woman in the, in the garden. Very hard working woman and is the cooperate with the people in the villages. Next week on Wednesday, there will be a funeral service at Bugrovi Church of Uganda before her body is transported to Kitigum, where she will be laid to rest on Thursday next week at St. Paul's Church Muchwini in Kitigum, right next to her husband. Jingo Francis, NTV.